What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today is a fantastic day to be a PlayStation gamer. We got deals of the week, baby. I'd love to hear you guys' thoughts and opinions about all of this in the comment section below. I am actually going to be doing polls on each and every video that I upload at the beginning of the video. So right now you should see a little tab at the top of the video letting you know that there's a poll. And you guys can participate it in it. I actually encourage uh, you guys to participate in it. I think that'd be awesome. I'd love to see your guys' opinions. And then you can also compare to like what other people think. Ooh, right? Because I, I know you guys are smashing the like buttons and getting crazy in the comment section below. But um, I love to, you know, run polls. I do that on Twitter and Hey, it's available on uh, YouTube too. So let's go ahead and get into the PlayStation Picks sale. Oh man, there's so much. Um, there's so so much goodness and, and great stuff available. A lot of people are like, "When is Grand Theft Auto V going to be on sale?" Well, guess what? If you got PlayStation Plus, you get this beautiful bundle right here for thirty four nineteen. Now, yeah, it's kind of you know 2016 was when this specific one got released but grand theft auto has been out for a while but you'll be surprised uh, of how many people actually want it so grand theft auto 5 and great white shark cash bundle original price was 75.99 and it's brought down to 34.99 that's pretty cool tech in seven yes please uh, get into my system, forty one ninety nine for that. I actually anticipate a, a bigger price discount later on, maybe during the holiday season. We'll have to wait and see. Let's go ahead and see all of the game deals. Dun dun dun! Oh my gosh, breaks my heart to see this. Well, because I paid full price for the game, but you guys get Need for Speed. For $7.99. Now, some people love the game. I personally liked it. I didn't love it. I liked it. I didn't really like the cutscenes. They were kind of cheesy. But, man, $7.99 breaks my heart to see that price. But, I mean, awesome for you guys, right? Uh, the Deluxe Edition is $12.49. You know, give or take. I mean, if you were thinking about getting Need for Speed, then you're probably going to want to get the Deluxe Edition. But if you were, like, on the fence, I don't know if I should get it. I don't know if it's good. $7.99, you can't beat that price. Rocket League's also on sale. Titanfall 2 Standard Edition, $11.99 for that. There's so many deals in here, I'm telling you guys. Dead or Alive 5, the last round, the full game, okay, is 20 bucks. It's on sale if you got PlayStation Plus. I would recommend playing the free version. I always say that. But they have a free version <clears throat> that's available. And if you pay for the full game, you'll you'll have access to all the characters, storyline, blah, blah, blah. But um, if you don't know if it's your cup of tea, try the free game first. It's pretty cool to see some PS2 games on the list like grand theft auto san andreas where's vice city though man come on bully's also on sale rumor has it that bully might be coming to the playstation 4 in uh you know a newer form but we'll have to wait and see don't bite your tongue or hold your breath whatever you want to say uh <laughs> we got the need for speed ea family bundle for fifteen ninety nine, okay. Scratch this. Scratch this. Okay, um, I wouldn't recommend this one. Uh, and you, you know, if you only have like eight dollars to spend, then hey, by all means. But for fifteen ninety nine, uh, Need for Speed, Plants vs Zombies, Garden Warfare Two, which will, uh, some people are still playing to this day. I have friends on my friends list that I see played. And Unraveled is a great game. It's a beautiful game. Um, and yes, I did make me, uh, you know, make my own, uh, little unraveled dude out of uh, twine. <laughs> if you guys follow me on Twitter, then you probably know. Um, oh, there's Vice City. PlayStation, you redeemed yourself. You got Vice City up in here. Mafia 3, Watch Dogs 2, uh, Resident Evil. There's a lot of, ooh, look at that. Street Fighter 5. Now, 
this is crazy, okay? Because this is a really popular EA, EA, eSport. I'm tripping. Yo, I'm tripping. This is a popular eSport game. And to see it on sale for 20 bucks, that's pretty freaking crazy. We got Grand Theft Auto, the trilogy, that's also on sale. Manhunt, there's some PS2 classics in here. I dig it, I dig it. Dishonored, Definitive Edition. You could probably find this game for about the same price. Physical copy, uh, but I mean, probably not the def Definitive Edition. Grand Theft Auto 3, I love that game. Max Payne, also a great game. You know, one thing that I noticed is a lot of the games that I used to play on the PS2, I'm like, I want to come to the PlayStation 4. But they just kind of like ported it over. It's not really remastered or anything. But it does have trophy support, so that's cool. But at the same time, I'm like, wow, the, these are the graphics I used to play. But then again, these TVs are a lot more advanced. So if like you were to plug in a PS2 into one of the old school box TVs, it probably look a little bit different. I'm scrolling through these because there's a hell of a lot of sales. It kind of feels like there's a flash sale. If you guys see any games that pop out at your face, smack you right across uh, the screen, uh, let me know in the comment section below. Also, what would you recommend uh, your fellow gamers to get if, you know, they didn't have a backlog of games? Rockstar Games, PS2 Classics, you got The Bully, you got Max Payne, Warriors, Red Dead Revolver, and Manhunt. And that is $37.49. Original price, $75. So, I mean, there's a lot of great PlayStation picks <laughs> Let's see the add-ons really quickly. I'm going to browse through this um, so quick. You, you're going to have to pause it to, to be able to see the price. Ooh, I see free. Download free. Hit that purchase on that free. You, you always got to get that free. Okay, so that's the add-ons. And I'm curious to see if there's any other deals other than, you know, what we've seen. And holy cow, there is. There's PlayStation Plus deals. There's game deals. I'm going to browse through this. Uh, kind of quick too because some of the games are going to be on repeat just because you know they were in the, the other one and this kind of showcases uh, more. Ooh NBA Live 18. I'm I'm definitely looking forward to, to playing that one. I want to see. I'm curious. I want to see what they got on the table for us this year. And uh, I mean come on dude. NBA 2K uh, you know is cool but we need we need competition. We need a run for their money. And I hope, I hope NBA Live is uh, or will be a run for their money. So that's pretty cool to see as well. There's so many games. I'm freaking out right now. Um, I haven't seen this many games on the U.S. side of things. Oh, Season Pass is free right now. Star Wars Battlefront Season Pass is free. What the heck? Um, hold on guys, I need to do this for me, okay? And then you do it for you, and then do it for your friends and friends and friends. Even if you don't have Star Wars right now, just download the Season Pass. <laughs> freaking Season Pass. I'm going to scroll because it shot me back up to the top freaking PlayStation. Um, I was right around... Where was I? Around... Here, I was right around here. Okay, so let's continue on, shall we? Oh man, there's like I said, there's so many, so many uh, games on sale. Oh my gosh, Monkey Flop, what is wrong with you? There's so many games on sale. That is an awesome game. There's a lot of really good games on sale. I'm just in disbelief right now because the EU gets all the deals, and oh, Life is Strange Episode Two is free. Uh, oh, the Monkey Flop Life is Strange is free right now. You're a freaking idiot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, now we're getting into the themes and avatars. Those lovely, lovely themes. We got movie deals. We got TV deals. Deals on deals on deals on stacks of deals. Now, there are going to be a couple of games on the PlayStation Plus discounts that we didn't see in the other list. So that's why I'm browsing through this. So don't get your panties in a while like Dream Break. Oh man, Resident Evil, great game. I definitely do recommend. Neverwinter is free to play, so I would definitely recommend trying it out. Giving it a shot, giving it a go. You have till Monday.
to be able to take advantage of the deals that you see. Dragon Quest Builders. Oh, that's awesome. Dragon Quest Heroes 2. This game I would definitely, 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 most definitely recommend. <laughs> if there was enough definitely's in there, maybe it's going to be in the title too. We'll just have to wait and see. Remember, there is a poll going on right now, so I appreciate you guys voting. If you guys, you know, appreciate what I what I do bringing you guys the deals each and every week and showcasing them and, you know, let, letting you know, like, uh, you know, a, a triple game Metro is on sale for five bucks. Like, what the heck? Is this a flash sale? No, it's not. So if you guys appreciate that, make sure to hit that like button. Comment down below. Even if you're like, what's up, monkey flop? Participate in that poll. And... Hit that subscribe button, bell notification. That way you guys know when I post a new video like this one. I posted like three videos yesterday like a maniac. I didn't really care. I'm like, oh, well, if people, you know, want to hear this information, then they're going to watch the video. So um, that's that. <laughs> Make sure you guys go and watch some of the other videos. We're getting into themes and avatars again. Yay. Yay. But, hey, the PlayStation Plus uh, pick sale is pretty freaking cool in my opinion but like i said i want to hear your guys's opinion in the comment section below anyways that's it for me enough of me rambling on i appreciate you guys and i'll see you guys in the next news update er, hold on we got earn double two times sony rewards points so uh, i had somebody ask me about sony rewards points prior and uh, I, I will explain it and go in a little bit further of detail in a later video. But Sony Rewards is basically sign up on PlayStation.com forward slash rewards. And you get double the points or sometimes you just get regular points. But right now it's got double points on price sale purchases. Uh, so there is some fine print that you got to read. And like I said, I'll explain it. A lot more later, but I just wanted to throw that out there that you can earn twice as much right now. Anyways, that's it for me. I appreciate you guys, and I will see you in the next news update. You guys are freaking awesome.